Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you how to do job costing with MYOB. First of all, I always like to use um, the shortcut method to create the job. So when you go to sales, enter sales, when you want to issue an invoice to your clients, and you will know this is which job or particular job size or project or whatever it is. Or maybe you want to use for your branch, also can. Maybe I have uh, three branch. I want to see each individual branch profit and loss. You can use jobs or you can use our category. You can have two options. So select a customer, ABC, private limited, and straight away ship is how many quantity? Maybe uh, 100 quantity for maybe chili A. Okay, and you two dollar. You can change the price to three uh, three dollars. And after that, look at here, job. Click the scroll down button and create new. And or you can please select the job A. Let's come with how to create a new one. Let's create a new job B. Maybe this is a new job site. Job site. Um, maybe it's uh, the HDB. And this is blocked. Uh, maybe. 880. So after you create a new one, you can select from here whether it's a job A or job B or whichever it is. Let's select the job B, the new one, and after that, straight away, I can print out as a invoice. Click the print and the preview. They ask you to record first, just click OK and scroll down to the sample invoice format. Of course, you can select back your customized format which normally will be your company name and IMD. So let's zoom in and take a look. Okay, there is the invoice. So click OK, done. So maybe I have some purchases, I buy the material or I engage the labor cost is for this project. Same thing, I can select back um, the supplier, maybe AV printing, Maybe I buy uh, 100 pieces of the um, part A for this project. Part A maybe is $1. And same thing, I tag back the same project, job B. So just click record. Um, yeah, just create a control. It's okay, done. So let's look at the reports. Go to reports and go to accounts and go to job. Profit and loss. You can select by the date range. You can show all project, or you can just show one project. Let's say I want to just see job B. I don't want to see all the irrelevant project. So job B, my income is three hundred. I got one hundred dollars is the material cost or equipment cost. So end of the day, I have a profit of two hundred dollars. One of another report is very popular is job transactions. If you want to see this particular job got how many transactions it involves, maybe you want to see who is the supplier, the material you have purchased from, you can look from this report. And from here, you also can see whether the balance is positive or negative. So positive is means it's a profit. Negative, it will be lost. So one glance, you can see everything. So thank you for today. Goodbye.